Hello everybody and welcome to my channel AK Toys here up in Alaska and I wanted to share with you today some very easy uh, pretty inexpensive mods to do to the Bay Yang Toys X16 um, Typhoon quadcopter which will just make it a much better toy fun play you know useful um, you know quadcopter and you know why not um, not a bad quadcopter. I have uh, another video out here, you know, of a review of what I've done with this since I've got it. Because I've been pretty impressed with this thing. This thing is a Sima X8 killer. Just a killer. I also have the other video out of the antenna mod that I did to the transmitter to increase the range because I like to fly FPV and I need that extra range. But let's just cover some really quick things here to do to this quadcopter that anybody can do. That's going to greatly improve your experience having this quadcopter. Now, this is a cheap quadcopter. I bought this for around 100 bucks with no camera because the camera sucks. And one of the first things I did was I put a gel mount camera thing on here, real cheap, a couple dollars. Um, mounted this on here. I mounted it further forward. It will lock right in here, but I mounted it further forward so that I don't have to take video and pictures with the damn gear legs in the way. So put it further forward, quadcopter flies fine with the weight being forward, it doesn't even know it's there. Um, and I've covered this on my other video. I'm flying with a Sima HD camera that shoots in 1080p. And this quadcopter has the same plug-in on the bottom. And you know, you buy this little camera separate if you want, and it comes with this little plug-in. Plugs right in, so on your transmitter top button take pictures bottom button turns on and off the video so you have that control which is nice flying around to take pictures um, and when I'm flying FPV uh, I don't even need this on here because I can see everything you know through this camera here and my fat shark dominators has a built-in SD card with DVR so I can record everything through my uh, goggles and I don't even need a camera but this is better nice good quality you know uh, film so and the other thing that I did back here was I and the battery fits in and out of this thing really nice lots of room um, I made a little hole in the door I run a voltage low voltage indicator you can always know what your battery's doing. You can set this by this little button here. I set it to 3.6 and this thing is really loud so it'll start beeping when my battery gets low. And by the way, this thing has really good flying times on this battery. Um, and the reason why I did this is, is because when you're flying it around, the lights are supposed to start flashing when the battery gets low and that's supposed to tell you to come land. But the lights also flash if you're doing video or pictures, so, so it gets confusing. Plus in the daylight, um, you know, when it's sunny, you're never going to see these lights. Not ever. But you'll hear this thing beeping. So that's why I like to run, you know, the low voltage indicator. It's just a really super cheap mod that'll save you from crashing a lot. Um, put some color on the front of these things so you can tell which way is what. I like to use the orange in the front. Um, some people can just, you know, you can spray paint stuff. But put some color on them because this thing in the air, you start spinning it all around this thing you don't know what direction you're going in sometimes so that'll save you a lot of you know guessing if you're going forward or backwards big improvement spin on self-locking props get rid of the little locking hub things these will spin right off makes it easy to transport these are i believe 9450 dgi phantom props and they are big see the clearance there you know these things get some bite and these brushless motors push these things and makes this thing just have the most wicked sound when you punch out hard it just you know really bites some air so i really like that about that much more improvement and this is a great little you know a little mod to really improve the performance on this thing is just to change the props out um and now up here you can see that I have mounted a really quick, simple little camera setup, and it's Velcroed on, and I just used a little piece of foam and some glue gun, um, running a 3S 650 uh, milliamp battery, which gives me tons of time on this tiny camera. This camera is a Yixing, 
uh, E-A-C-H-I-N-E, I believe. E Shing, I got it from Banggood for 22 bucks. Now this camera is not like a lot of them out there. This is actually a 200 milliwatt camera and it's a camera VTX and antenna four leaf antenna too so you get a lot less cut out as you're flying around because it has better coverage really like these cameras and this camera has a super good picture with a really nice wide angle of view so when I'm flying I actually see everything in front of me and these arms so I I mean I see these arms past these arms actually when I'm flying so it's not like I'm flying you know through a straw now that might be different on different uh, headsets and goggles but i am using a really uh good pair of fat shark dominator v3s and these things best money i've ever spent the range the coverage just the i can't say enough about these i'll do a, i'll do a review on these sometimes love these things so anyway if you're if you're looking to get something and do a few mods on it and you know make yourself a fun little toy this is what i've done with mine um i'm i'm really looking forward to seeing what other people are you know doing with theirs as far as i can tell this hasn't really been out that much it's kind of new i think they're uh, developing a gps version of this for around 249 you could have gps return to home fail safe uh which would be nice when i'm flying uh fpv because i get out there you know i like to go exploring um and i don't like to go exploring all the time with my expensive quadcopters because hell i mean this thing is you know at the price i'm into it for it's kind of disposable so anyway i hope you like my video uh please subscribe to my channel if you like my channel and uh, hit the like button and ak toys up here uh fly safe uh, have fun uh catch you next time later